Today I'm making a short video about uh, what uh, used Mac you can buy that supports the latest OS in 2021 and the lowest, uh, the latest OS uh, on Mac these days for 2021 is OS Monterey 12.x, uh, OS 12 basically. Um, and the reason why I was, I made this video is because I was actually trying to find a, a used MacBook or iMac so I could do testing on the latest OS. I could probably use VMware or whatever, I mean, Cloudware or whatever, but uh, I like to have an actual physical machine. And all my machines are too old. I own a 2011 iMac and a 2013 MacBook Pro. So I just wanted to post this information on here. So if you wanted to get a MacBook Pro, you'd have to get something from 2015 or newer. Uh, Mac Mini, uh, you would have to buy a 2014 Mac Mini or newer. And for an iMac, you'd have to buy a 2015 iMac or newer. I only do this just because I, I don't want to spend full price for a Mac and I don't really use it to do anything crazy. Um, originally, I was going to look at, at a Mac Mini, uh, the M1s. Uh, for These days... It, for Christmas, they seem to be on sale, and you could probably get something for around the same price as a refurbished a Mac Mini. Um, I think uh, right now it's like 800 something for a 16 gigabyte model. I wish it was cheaper. Uh, uh, most of the models they sell are just for in increasing the, what do you call it, storage size, not the memory size. So over here you have 589, 759, and 759. They're not for the ones that are, what do you call it, larger memory. It's just larger storage, which isn't a big deal to me. I would just plug in a USB stick or even just plug in, I don't know, just plug in something else to give you more storage. Because um, I think it's kind of pretty expensive to add 256 gigabytes of storage data and it costs $160 or whatever. And so originally, yeah, I own these older uh, iMacs and older MacBook Pros, and they don't support the latest OS anymore. So I found a website that uh, shows a list of them pretty easily. This is eShopsMacSales.com. I, I haven't bought anything from this website yet, or I haven't done it before, but they have a nice uh, uh, compatibility guide, which I like, that lists them from the newest First, they list all the devices, and then you can expand, and it goes from the newest device down, and it shows you what's supported and what's not supported. Because even even the newest ones, they they might not be supported with older OSs, like the M1 iMacs. They not supported su supported with the old OS 10 uh, operating systems. So I use this to figure out uh, which ones were supported. So. Um, good luck with your uh, purchasing used uh, purchasing a used uh, iMac if you don't want to buy a new one or a new Mac Mac device.